Goes well over the 450. Burring Bar Blue looks the only danger. 11 to 7, 59 dollars. Dixie Cath off box number one. As the bunny set into motion, we're set for the first leg of the Quaddy Grafton. Ready? Racing, Dixie Cath was quickly into stride, out well the favourite, Ice to Fire to challenge. A break of a length and a half to Aussie Fury, wide on the track, Burring Bar Blue, Liberty Valance, Bock Arm Bull. Back to the tail was Goddess of War, favourite took over on the side, Ice to Fire put three lengths now on Dixie Cath into second. Behind those runners was Burring Bar Blue, followed by best of the rest, Aussie Fury, but it's a one act affair, Ice to Fire is clear. Ice to Fire, too good for Dixie Cath, grabbing third, Burring Bar Blue, in front of Aussie Fury, a break then to Goddess of War, Liberty Valance, the tail ender was Bock Arm Bull and a good run, 25 and 30. Their favourite too good. Six first, Ice to Fire. Has dominated. 906, 1971 the splits, 566 on the way home. Stop, stopping the clock at 2537. New PB for Ice to Fire, eclipsing his previous best of 25.43. And he's got the job done here at short odds, defeating one Dixie Cath. Third goes to eight, Burring Bar Blue. And fourth to number three, Aussie Fury. Six, one, eight and three, the interim placings. Five and a quarter lengths the winning margin. Five and a quarter. Was well, the winning margin. Two and a quarter between second and third. Five and a quarter by two and a quarter. Six, one, eight and three, the interim result. Ice to fire. There's a black dog, Shimmer Shine, fire on ice for Mark and Melissa Maroney. Defeating number one, Dixie Cath for John Corrigan. Third goes to eight, Burring Bar Blue for Rob Andrews. And fourth to three, Aussie Fury. Six, one, eight and three. Five and a quarter by two and a quarter. 25-37 the run after Grafton race number five. All clear on the numbers six, one, eight, and three. It's all clear to pay on Grafton race number five. Up out there wider. 